Bishop Brewer, 11 years ago when you became our bishop, the Bishop of the Diocese of Central Florida, you took on the responsibility for all spiritual affairs of this diocese. In my work with you as chancellor, I've had the opportunity to see you make many decisions that many, perhaps most, would not think of as spiritual matters, matters involving discipline, matters involving personnel, hiring and firing, matters involving the use of resources, matters involving schools and their administration, and many other matters a business the size of our diocese might encounter. In all cases, you demonstrated compassion, wisdom, kindness, and patience in resolving issues, minimizing, and if at all possible, avoiding conflict. All of this took hard work and time on your part, but it enhanced the spiritual health of our people and all of those in our diocese in many ways that only those directly involved will fully appreciate. As you did this, you worked hard, long hours. You traveled many, many miles and made many, many visitations. The people of our diocese appreciated your efforts and the leadership you demonstrated. You've also given generously of your time and talents to the Episcopal Church and the House of Bishops. More than once, you've answered the call from our presiding bishop to help with efforts to find ways to be a unifier. For example, you were appointed to the Communion Across Difference Task Force, and you were the chair of the Evangelism Committee at General Convention. Bishop Brewer, thank you for answering God's call to lead the Diocese of Central Florida for these past 11 years.